Alright guys, welcome back. It is April 15th. We set this morning and we seen two hens, heard a couple gobbles. <laughs> I'm with uh, my girlfriend Allie. She's never been able to come with me to uh, my spot, but uh, we just got tucked back up in here for the evening hunt. We plan on setting till dark, but uh, hopefully we can shoot one early and um, not have to worry about it. Trent and Dad doubled up this morning, so uh, we're two for two. Hopefully I can make it three for three, but um, we're going to get set up and... Good luck.
15 minutes. Yeah. I'll turn around behind me. And I'll see the bird coming through that fence row right there. <laughs> <laughs> Howdy. Let's go get him. Howdy. God, <laughs> you're shaking. Dude, he's down. He's down. What? He's down. He's down. You killed him. Yep. He's right there. Shot him ten yards. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're gonna walk up here right now. Like I said, we've been set up for maybe 15 minutes. I hit the box call two times. Gave it probably like seven or eight yelps. And I looked back in these cedars, and a bird was coming hot in, never made a peep, never gobbled or nothing. Which I just finished telling her that if one comes in, it'll probably come in silent. So it's that time of the day, it's hot, they're not really vocal. But uh, he came in on a beeline. I shot him the closest I've ever shot a turkey in my life. He was probably 10 yards, so we're going to go with that. success that's uh two two years in a row i've had basically the same hunt i've set up in the morning not had much luck and then i uh, go home get lunch come back and set and last year on opening day and obviously this year i've set for 15 minutes shot one both times so uh he's not my biggest bird but uh he's definitely a good bird good body bird and uh, now we're gonna head off try to get Hallie a bird this evening and hopefully go four for four with everybody that's been hunting. So uh, thank you all for watching and good luck to everybody.